Hello and welcome to my video. This video is loading free country styles into the PSR E463 keyboard. If you want to play country music on your E463, you only have eight choices. There are eight country styles that come built into this little keyboard. And that's just not enough. In this video, I will show you where you can get 196 free country styles available on the internet, and these will all play on the PSR E463 keyboard. In this video, I will show you where those country styles are located on the internet and how to get them into your E463 keyboard using a USB thumb drive. I will be using my 14 year old MacBook computer to do this. I could easily use my 6 year old iPhone or my 8 year old iPad to do this. My point is you don't need brand new state of the art technology to do what I'm about to show you. If you use an iPhone or an iPad, you'll also need the Apple Lightning to USB 3 camera adapter to connect the USB thumb drive up to your iPhone or your iPad. You can order this online directly from Apple. It's somewhere between $35 and $40. Now, there are four limitations I want to mention right off of the bat. Number one, the files must be 50K or less in size. And of the 196, I think there are only probably three or four that are bigger than that. But that's the maximum size uh, style file you can load. Number two, when you put these files on your thumb drive, they must be on the root level. For you non-technical people, what that means is you can't put them inside a folder. No folders are allowed. You have to put the files directly on the thumb drive. Do not put them inside a folder. Number three, you can only put 150 of these styles on a USB thumb drive at any one time. And number four, you can only load 10 styles at a time into the memory slots of the E463. And I'll talk more about that in a few moments. So these are the four gotchas you have to watch out for. So where are the country style web pages on the internet? And by the way, I will list these web pages, the URLs for them in my comments below. This is what the first one's going to look like. It's called John Vernon's Collection. And when you get here, you come in at the top and as you'll see, and I'll do this all live in a moment, I'll scroll all the way bottom because I have to get all the way down here. The, this little zip, number N zip, this is Country, Dixie, and Bluegrass Music. That's what the N stands for. And this is the one we'll click. I'll do this live, bear with me. The second one is a funny name, www.wormpsr. I don't know who this guy is. He must be Russian because he tells me you can email him in either English or Russian. And when we get to his page, this is what we're going to click. And by clicking this one uh, button here, this one word, we will download a folder full of country western styles and every one of them will play in the E463. So you're going to need to know how do you load a style off of a thumb drive and get it stored inside the E463. And here are the steps. And if you have an owner's manual, this is all on page 75. If this looks confusing and if you read it and still don't understand, I've got good news for you. About a little less than a year ago, I put up a 40 minute YouTube video that tells you exactly what you need to know to be able to take 
a style that is stored on a USB thumb drive and get that loaded into one of the 10 memory locations on your E463. And I'm, I'm happy to see as of today, 26,280 people have watched this YouTube to learn how to do this. So you can be one too. Now I'm going to play 10 of these country styles in this YouTube so you can hear them. And these are the ones that I chose. These all happen to come from that Worm PSR website. And once again, you can only load 10 styles at a time into the 10 memory slots, which are numbered 236 to 245 on the keyboard. So I may have, um, you know, 110, 120 styles loaded on my thumb drive, but I can only put 10 of them at a time inside the keyboard. So let's go live and download the country styles into the Macintosh and then transfer them into the USB thumb drive. So I'm done with this presentation. I'm going to close that up. And now I'm going to open up this folder and I'm going to start by taking you to the John Vernon website. Here it is. So when you come into this, you have to scroll all the way down to the bottom, the very bottom, right here. Now these are all lettered A, B, C, D, E, and fortunately there's a little table, let me scoot up a moment, and it says that the letter N stands for country, Dixie, and bluegrass. So this is the only place you can go, this table three. So I'm going to click on this N zip in table three. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to download 131 country, Dixie, and bluegrass, bluegrass styles. Ready? Click. Boop. I'll show you where they went in just a moment. So I'm half done. Now I'm going to leave this and I'm going to take you to what I call the worm page. And by the way, I will put both of these URLs in the comments down below so that you can click on them and you can come here directly yourself. All right, what I'm looking for is the third one down, the country. And when I click this, what I will be doing is I will be downloading a folder that has dozens and dozens of country styles and every single one of them will play on the E463 keyboard. So here we go. Click. Bloop. Okay, I'm done. What I've done is I have downloaded those folders into the hard drive of my Macintosh. And let me go and show them to you now. Here is my download folder. And here are the two folders that I just downloaded. This is the first one, John Vernon. If I open it up, what I see is a bunch of other folders. Bluegrass, ballad, uh, boogie, country, country rock, country shuffle, countries. He has organized is country music by categories. Let me just open up one of them. Ready? Click, click. And let me turn it into a list view. So in just this one folder, there are dozens and dozens of country styles, and every one of them will play on the E463. Just for fun, let me organize these by size. And it turns out only one won't play. This, the, this one is 53K, and remember what I said, the limit is 50K. So of all of these styles, every single one of them will load and play in your E463, except this one. That's the only one, and it's too big. 
it's 53K and the limit is 50K. All right. So let me open this again. Now, uh, right here is my thumb drive. And let me do this. Let me, let me delete everything on it. I don't want there to be anything on here. So I've just eliminated everything on that thumb drive. It's completely empty. Now let me go back into my download folder and uh, let me open up this folder and uh, let me change that to a list. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer some of these styles from that folder sitting in my downloads into this thumb drive. So I'll click here and uh, I'll click here and save everything in between. Now with my mouse, I'll go click, drag, drop. So what I've just done is I have transferred all of these country styles into my thumb drive. So now what I'll do is I'll take this thumb drive and I will insert that into the back of my E463 keyboard and I will load 10 of those styles into my keyboard. And once again, if you don't know how to do that, go and watch that video that I put up that tells you how to load styles from a thumb drive into the memory of your E463 keyboard. So now let's go to my keyboard. And by the way, I have already gone through the process of loading 10 of those files into the memory of my keyboard. And I, I started a stopwatch just so you know how long does this take? It took me six minutes total to load those 10 country styles into the 10 memory locations of my E463. So I've already got them in there. So when we go live, uh, I'm going to start having already installed 10 of the styles into the keyboard. Let's go to the keyboard. Here we are at the keyboard and I'm going to start playing the 10 country styles. The first one is 64 folk R. And I will start by playing the intro B and then I'll play both A and B variations and then I will end each one with the uh, ending B. So each style has two introductions, A and B. It has two variations, A and B. And each style has two endings, A and B. So in the next th 10 songs I'm going to play, I will start always with intro B, and I'll switch back and forth from A and B, the main parts, and I will end with ending B. Okay, so here we go. The first one is 64 Folk R. This is B. This is A. And the ending This next one is Blue 
grass, G-R-A-S, bluegrass. Ready? Here is A. Here is B. This next one is Country Step 2, CNT 2 Step, Country 2 Step. Here is intro B. This next one is Mod Dash Folk. Intro B. long ending. This next one is Country Ballad, spelled B-L-L-D, Country Ballad, starting with intro B. long ending. This next one is Country Rock, CNT Rock 1, Country Rock 1. A.
This next one is country, spelled with all cap letters, country, intro B. Here's A. This next one is Country Pop. Intro B. Here's A. This next one is Cowboy Boogie, Cow Boogie, starting with intro B. This is A. ending. This last one is Folk, F-O-L-K, starting with intro B. Here's A. So you've just heard 10 of the country styles, 
There's 186 more that you can download and listen to. I hope you have found this useful and helpful. Until I see you again, thanks for watching and be well.